Oh, come on, gamer here. Do hot chisel and a travel. Um, good tips is um traveling is to um. Fall asleep if you feel tired on an airplane, just do it. Um, use noise counseling headphones you can hook up to the entertainment system. Because there's relaxation music in the entertainment system now. It depends on uh, what flight you have. But you can just watch TV, which could help you out. Um... My thing is, um, pack some food and my other thing to help you out uh, on the spectrum is if uh, I found something that's too loud, just to wear noise counseling headphones and just do that. And um, if a passenger is starting to bother you, ignore them. And if they continue, just hit the call button. A flight attendant will come and... Or some flight crew will come and help you out. Whether it be the purser, the flight attendant, uh, the head flight attendant, uh, yeah. So, or the cabin attendant whatever they're called but yeah and if someone keeps asking you that for them to take photos out the window and it's bothering you uh hmm maybe just put headphones on and just listen to music on your tablet or something like that yeah <laughs> Sometimes people try to talk to you in another language and it may be a foreign language to you, just, um, just sit there. <laughs> yeah, that's my suggestion. And another thing is, um, if someone keeps bothering you and continues, just press the call button. And the best time to do it, if they go to the washroom and then press it, and then just tell the flight attendant that they're bothering, that the passenger sitting in your row is bothering you, and then they'll keep an eye on it, and then if they continue, just press it, then they'll just probably pull aside that passenger, and just tell them to stop. And if a passenger behind you keeps kicking your seat, press the call button and tell the flight attendant. That's the best thing to do. Yeah, and if someone keeps trying to put down your window shade, um, this call if I intended. And I did press the call button because my phone fell in between the seat, but then I got it. And then the fire attendant came a bit too late, but I pressed the bu call button. And I said, yeah, my phone was bit gone, but I got it. I think they were dealing with something back of the plane or something, but that's okay. Yeah, I did press the call button, but then they came too late. But those are all my helpful tips for autism and traveling. Just pack a lot of stuff that could help you calm down if you feel overwhelmed. And just try to sleep because that can really help you. And listen to the relaxation music because it will help you go into a deep sleep and you'll start to dream of all your favorite things.